Hey there, I'm the Cell Cowling VIP6, and last time I, we played for a whole video of Blue Switch Palace. Now, had I not fallen for a fake switch trap like twice, I probably would have went on by to this yellow dot, but I, there was enough time spent that I didn't want to take a chance. Athletic on a name is always scary, but Rift Valley makes it sound like a place. So I really don't know what to expect, ultimately. So in this controller selected like well are we here? So many things get used to. Alright, so we got hot coffee. Uh I got just bumbling into that guy. Alright, here's a saw blade. <laughs> this is always a really good start. Like that guy did not like try particularly hard to be a powerful Mario and uh, me just stay there. You can stand okay, well in this one you can't just stand on it. But in the other one you can yeah, apples! They taste great when chewed thoroughly. So here you give platforms here and there. Alright, normally, yeah, you'd be rushing through the diaper rocks, but hey man, I've earned that blue block, blue switch, blue blue zone. I'm just pressing buttons as soon as I see them. Maybe eventually that will be a trap. It's possible. I cannot deny that possibility. I'm try almost try to go in that thing, but it didn't really work out. So normally, yeah, I have to do a big awkward jump to here, but I don't have to. Man, yeah, like this is like the perfect timing. I've finally gone. Dang it! I've finally gone. That blue switch. All right, Fisherman Jim. That's right, Coffee Town. Yoshi. That's a strange animal. Yeah, that's all I have to say about that, apparently. <laughs> what strange- oh, well, there he goes. He had fun. He touched the side of a little red guy. And he- away he started to run. Just sheer panic. What a ridiculous event. The sky is nice and blue. The clouds are round and white. Here's the midpoint. I- should I? You know what? No. No, no, no. Just restart if you get- if you die. It's fine. Did it once right now. Do it again. I am all about abusing the fact that the blue switch was pressed yesterday. <laughs> and a red switch the other day. This is like the, hey, rewards for hitting switches day. Here, valley. Shoot, I panicked there a little bit. See, that's really unfortunate, because... Oh, shoot, what am I doing? Because... Packing is so unfortunate. I don't know if those blue coins mean you want to go inside this pipe. No, it's just opportunity to put money. Alright, looks like you're just always safe on this thing. Sweet. Then you can do that, and you're like... Yeah, I could bounce on the node blocks, but I also don't have to. <laughs> That's, that's the great part. It's when, you know, life gives you options. I feel like I bought my head. Wow. Wow, what a rude little one-up ploy here, you know? As you, just, you try to jump the guide and you bought your head instead. Fascination is a new brand of force speed. Don't buy it. Watch out for Bullet Bill Crossfire up ahead. Oh boy, I love me some generators. I mean, it smells like a generator. Like a cross, yeah, here we go. Here's that old pal. Um, yeah, it's that old pal. Mr. Crossfire. Uh, so just kind of go. Like really the trick with Crossfire is don't panic and just kind of always move, but like, don't be dumb. See, that's an example of being dumb. All right, yeah. So just be careful. Analyze. Fractalize. Run out of time. That's bad. Didn't expect that to become a thing. The level that expects you to have died. I'm just gonna jump on the switches. There we go. You guys fly off over there. I need to bounce on a bullet to get on top there to get these prizes. Is it worth it? I mean, I might just lose my big immediately. Alright, welcome to Thundering Mountain. Everything is constructed of awkward squares. How's it going? The most thunderous squares in the world. Look at that! One shot try! I should have done this yesterday. I missed the, I missed the points. I missed my stars though. That feels kind of silly. Ah, uh, Boom's got a big old eyeball, but only for a second. Oh man, I could have done this yesterday. 
easily, but you don't know! That's the thing! I am living in fear. I almost said in sphere. That's not quite true yet. A castle in upheaval. There's a culture note somewhere. Let's just go. Let's enjoy the gum. Um, strenuous exercise like spin jumping while under the influence of upheaval is able to bring on nausea. So please have restraint. Okay, so I guess I'm not yet in upheaval influence. Influence. Okay, but that's gonna happen at some point. And I'm, not, I'm gonna want to not do it. Oh, this is a scary little thing. Well, I mean, this is clearly meant where you do that. Oh my gosh, just wow, you can clearly tell that he's backwards because he himself is backward. Are we gonna do the level backwards now, I wonder? So, upheaval? Yo. Okay, and pressing the spin jump button does nothing. It just, uh, I'm pressing in here. Uh, it just, okay, so, I can't duck either. I'm just in this weird, like, uh, semi-quasi land. I just jump, like, way too high. Okay, this is kind of a mind-bending event here. Just gonna have to... Uh. So, I can bop these if I want. I can bop this and return back to normal. This is fascinating, but here, clearly, it wants me to upheave, but I can't! So I have to do this the other way. Okay. Got it. But I can spin jump now, so I feel happy. Uh, Dagadon. Oh, really? I can't get it that way? So, note for the future. I need to stay in upheaval mode. Well, I can just get it here then, probably. Maybe? Kind of sneak in, get hurt in a dumb way, then you go like, eh, then you go like, eh, and I get hit like everything. There's, oh jeez. Yeah, I don't know. After my initial upheaval, wow, okay, so that won't work. Yeah, you cannot duck at all. It's just, it's just no ducking forever. Okay, yeah, here you can just jump over him. Like, there are things you can do, you just need to be... Oh, so that will still work. Got it. Alright, yeah, so like, it's tempting to be afraid. But don't. <laughs> that's... That's my hint. Look, I know you want to be scared, just don't, though. Yeah, I just keep being afraid of touching the lava there. Well, I don't know, yeah. Uh, normally I'm pretty good at uh, predicting my arcs, but switch things upside down, my reflexes just fall down the gutter. I mean, being big doesn't matter really, but I do not have that option. Do a big, nice jump, like you're used to. Yeah, just wait for the potabo and jump confidently. It's like a lot of things in Mario's. It's really all about confidence. Here, you know, yeah, there's that form there. Whatever, man. Jump confidently. Be confident. All right. Uh, there's a potabo around. Yeah, so I'm gonna wait for him to pass. I'm gonna mess it up here. It's fine. Yeah, there's a potabo here. That's fine. Oh. Uh. Okay. So. I was rewarded for dealing with the gimmick with a midpoint. Looks like otherwise you can't get it. And... Okay, so the level it looks like at this point is like... Wait, I can't go on these at all? I can, okay, you just need to, you know, cross the threshold. Right, and spin jumping will give me nausea. Uh... Well, well, I can probably get that on the way back, though. Like, the goal here is that I'm probably just... Ah! Oh boy, this feels weird, though. But yeah, what the whole gimmick here is that I'm probably just going on a trip to the bottom to flip around back, but... But this is difficult? Like, I don't... I wish I... Ah! Yeah, so, well, gonna have to replay, turns out. 
If I had kept my big and continued, I probably would have been okay. Alright, so, well, this is a sweet respawn room that we miss out on, though. Uh... Wow, that's really uncomfortable, actually. <laughs> and, yeah, see, and we're just right back here so we don't get any hits in there. But I don't... Uh, I don't like this, first of all. Why do I move so much? It feels like I shouldn't. Like, what do I... What do I do? Here. Like, do I go above him? That wouldn't work. Oh, boy. Okay. I... Oh. Well, normally I could spin jump, and that would do a world of difference. We're having so much trouble here, but... Oh, uh, that doesn't work. Like, this just feels capital B bad. And there I keep under jumping, because I'm afraid of touching the swamp, because the game's like, power-ups, nah, those don't actually exist. So I lost my cape, I can't help but notice, so that's good to know. I would still get it, just to be able to get a, an extra power-up, though. I did it! I tanked two hits to be able- Tabarnak! Like, why do I have no sense of space? Just take the hit and erase my hit down here. Then I can get an extra hit here. Is there any other hits along these blocks? No, okay. Look, man, I'll take it. Well, he knew what we were doing with the placement of those. Like. I get the nausea thing about the no spin jump, but how do you explain the no duck jump? Ah, tell, dude, how, why, how, where? No, that. Why am I having so much trouble controlling myself? Never before have I been so befuddled by a piece of Super Mario World. Here we are. Okay, I'm gonna be safe here, directly underneath it, so I should be able to do a big jump here. Alright. Dude, dude, what? No, what? But, like, that's the thing. I keep, like, I keep over jumping, but I don't get why. Like, I, I get, I... Like, that. Like, how did I let that happen, for example? Like, being upside down... ...shouldn't have an impact. But it just happened twice. But why? Like, why? Did... Are the physics changed in some way? That... I'm not aware of. That's not... Ah, tabarnak! This should not be hard. This should not be hard. This should not be- Hey, that little guy wasn't there last time. Uh, does it change everything? Yes. Yes, it does. Can't duck, but it doesn't matter. Alright, so just hang up here. This time, it's fine. Okay. New things. Blue zone. Fair enough. Okay, let's take up here. There's the last Dagadon, if that's relevant to your interests. See, jump upside down. Sure. One day, yeah, like I said, it's like, I don't have my refined moves. I just don't see why being upside down should affect so much. But it really affects my ability, it feels like, to... Go left or right at the right time. 
Uh, okay, so that's not where I wanted to be. I wanted to be here, and here I got to do that same siege out with, with spikes. Yeah, that's... That's gonna happen. Ugh, dude, duh, like... Dude, duh! No, it's one hard, I think... Maybe I jump there from the brown blocks, then... Ah! Uh, I am miserable. I am just awash with misery right now. It's fantastic. On top of here. Ah! Okay, I guess that won't work. I need to do it from here. Okay, fair enough. And then I just trip over myself constantly because that's just what I do in this level. Okay, okay, yeah. Stop trying to do impossible things. But it's not impossible things! These are very simple jumps! And yet here I am, bumbling around like a super clown. Like, I like to think that I'm a reasonably okay Mario player. And feeling like the mayor of Clown City just makes me feel so bad. I... I am feeling like... Super garbage right now. I am not happy. I am extremely not happy. Playing a level that's hard, awesome. Playing a level that is super easy, simple, major basic, but it's only hard because I never feel in control. I I I want to transform into a garbage truck right now and start a new life eating garbage every day. Like that's it's, well, there's fight, there's there's flight, and then there's just sitting there like a deer in the headlights. It's a three fear response. I don't know how to get past here. Ah, and just wasted my hit, so I'm just dead. Yay! Celebration! Ba ba la ba la bow! Way, look at that. I'm here with all my hits. Lost one immediately. And then lost the other- I- I don't understand. Like, this is what's killing me, is that. I keep going too far left, too far to the right, and I don't know what- Like, how do you do- uh, Okay, I can go here. It's not where I want to go, though. So jump here, and jump here. Okay. Duh, of course you put a spike there. Of course you put a spike there. Why wouldn't you put a spike there? You have to put a spike there. I didn't- You know what? I'm just gonna destroy myself here. I don't know how to do that part without getting hit. I'm not gonna lose five minutes of my life to just fail at it. Just go ahead and remove that life, and we're just gonna move on right ahead. Good times are being had by all. Mystery zone. Okay, okay, okay. Whew, okay. Alright, we gotta climb our way back up. Now, like, see, now we're gonna experience the level right side up. And because I got things such as, you know, duck jumping and spin jumps and the enemies not spawning. Like, the enemy's really not spawning. It's gonna be so much easier. Like, and past enemies now spawning. What is going on with this level? Alright, uh, can I just do this? Yes, I can. I can just do this too. 
here. I want to be on the other side. Uh, you know what? You can just do that. See, here I'm having fun again. The game makes sense. And this is kind of neat. Yeah, like, everything just despawned. Yeah, I got the thing. I think there's a way to get it, though, on your first pass while you're upside down, if you are already big. Alright, let's see what a boss looks like. That's just Roy. <laughs> it's just pathetic old silly Roy. Not even extra strength. You know what? You do you, game. You do whatever you want, because it sure as heck ain't me that's gonna stop you. Well, you know what? This, like, playthrough through the, the, the level normally does a lot to mitigate a lot of my climbing frustration, because I did feel really bad for a moment. I don't know why I was having so much trouble, but because of that, I felt like I was being hurt in a real deep place. As, as Boone said upon leaving the house that was unlike any before, "'Twas too far ahead of its time, I thought it needed to be no more." Oh, hey. Didn't know Boone was a Ludite. Oh, that, that hill climbed just a little bit, just for fun. PIPE! Alright, what's the culture zone? Uh, the castle cutscene in Japanese uses a phrase that translates more literally to too early for mankind. This phrase is also a common tag on media sharing services in Japan, and it's, perhaps ironically, put on things which are too bizarre or outrageous to be popular now, but may be more fully appreciated by a future society with different tastes. Wow, it's like the author knew this level felt like super garbage. I mean, you can't do that and not be aware. Hey, so there are more cave things. So World 5 is have the cave, and then also, I guess you pop up on that pipe? I'm not sure in what order I'm gonna be doing things. Okay. If... I can make it to the middle big... I think I'm going to be alright. Well, yeah, if I- uh, if I take the midpoint... Do I dare take no midpoint is a thing. Man, this feels like a billion years ago. I mean, uh, do I take the midpoint? That's a really good question. Cause, I mean, okay, well, we'll see in what state of video game I am when I get there, I guess. Whoops, I made a mistake. Well, why'd you go there? Because like a lot of things, this level isn't that bad once you've done everything once. That was a demo. I don't know what I'm demoing, but it was a demo. <laughs> huh. Okay, I'm gonna take the gamble. I'm going to... I'm gonna lean on my theory that hard levels, after you've just done it, redoing them should be easier. Now with that said, I realize because I've never figured out that part out there, I'm technically going to have one hit less tab on that than when I was doing it for real. But I mean, we'll, we'll see what happens. Because, yeah, I got one hit less, but I have knowledge, and, I mean, that's worth something in the black market. If you... There you go, got my hit back. Yeah, there we go! Wow. Pull that one off. Alright, this guy is kind of scary. You just do that, then you do that. It's whatever. Ooh, should I get this now? Yeah, strictly speaking, it's going to be easier to get now than later. I jumped right on those spikes, like that was... But... Probably worth... Maybe worth... This is the next big thing. Uh, okay, well, if I got myself hurt, I'm just gonna keep moving. Last big hurdle here. Okay, okay. That is the last big hurdle. 
No, you just need a... <laughs> now I just need to make it to the end, slash start, complete the loop. See, yeah, going in there with the camera, camera, the gravity this side, I don't think I would have been able to. Or I would have had to take a hit in the spikes regardless. No, this I can see, Joe. Eh, like that. Um, I guess I want to be here, so I can do this. Oh, I think you could tell, maybe, that I was not acting with full confidence there. That's fine. Go. Rest my hands for a second. There we go, here we go, here we go. Here we go.